Freelancer with Rented Reviews. Very excited to share with you what is in this box. It's not a box within a box this time, just the box. This is the Logitech Combo Touch iPad Pro, 11 inch for first, second, and third generation iPad Pros. I am extremely excited for this case. I love technology, I worked at Apple. I had a best case, hands down, I ever had for an iPad with Logitech. And this is my second Logitech case for an iPad Pro. Uh, it's got a keyboard, backlit, hard shell case around, Apple Pencil Rule for the Apple Pencil, which I don't have, but I'll probably get. It's got a stand on the back. And one of my most excited items that it has is a trackpad that basically turns your iPad into a laptop. So sometimes you can use a mouse, Bluetooth mouse. This has a trackpad built in and it utilizes a smart connector to function properly. So I'm, I'm excited for all that. I'm a nerd out on this. So we have the backlit keyboard, high precision click anywhere trackpad and smart connector, no charging or pair. So you don't have to charge or pair it. You just utilize the smart connector. The smart connector utilizes the iPad's battery supply to power the case. So no charging. So excited. Moment of truth. Da -na -na -na. Combo touch. Got all your numbers, your options. Look at that case, canvas style case. Ooh, ooh, that touchpad feels good. So I'm sorry, there's no competition. I bought this case because I wanted a good case. Kind of cheaped out on the last case. It only lasted about for a year. It was good. Had a backlight. Had a you know decent sized case, but. We're actually gonna make the swap because I'm that excited. It's got an instruction booklet. It's pretty straightforward. Smart connector, combo touch, all that, but bam. Instructions. Oh, it's also got a stand. I don't know if I mentioned that. So this is the new case. This is my old case. It held up well. I mean, the outside of it's not bad. It's got a little bit of chips and marks. Open it up. The keyboard was magnetic. It works, but you close it and it claps, claps hard against the glass. I don't like that. And also, one of the keys popped out. Unrepairable, in my opinion. So, I say a Vita Zen to this case. And goodbye. I'm gonna pop it out. Yeah. Ugh. Such a beautiful iPad. It's been in need of a lovely case. <laughs> I also engraved mine because Apple has an engraving service for their iPads. My company name is Bullseye Productions because I like guns and I always have. And using a camera is like using a gun. You're shooting video. All right, iPad going in via the smart connector. Make sure it's the right way. Oh, my iPad could use a clean. Watch people are gonna be like, you're pushing too hard. <laughs> I made a common mistake and placed it in. Oh no, that's a part of the design. Part of the corners are exposed on the case. It's not a flaw, it's part of the design, I suppose. And then smart connector on the bottom. Just kidding. <laughs> this is the Apple Pencil smart connector. This thing's got three smart connectors. Oosh, look at that magnetics, hold up. Mag, netic. One more because my hand is in the way. Mag, netic. <gasps> as soon as it's connected, as soon as you're connected, you're on the trackpad, dude. All right, that already surpassed my expectations. Ooh, keyboard is nice. Let's see the stand. Ooh, give it to him. Oh my god, guys, I'm I'm in love. So this case retailed $200. My last case retailed like $45. So you get what you pay for. This was my birthday present to myself. I'm now 31 years old, and I'm very excited to use this. So I mainly bought this because I'm a video editor by nature, and I've always wanted to be able to go on the go, but I like iPads over laptops. Laptops are also wicked expensive. I'm gonna to try to edit some Ranch's Reviews videos on this iPad see how it goes. That way I can edit anywhere and I'll get more videos out. So 
Thanks for tuning in to this episode of Ranch's Reviews. This is part one, the unboxing and initial assessment. And we're gonna do part two, where I reflect on it, use it, demonstrate it, and let you guys know how I like it. So thanks for tuning in. Until next time, see you on the next review. Thank you.